as an art form is relatively a new idea. And sculptural clothing, um, as far as I can see or know, there are only two other people in, on this continent that are doing similar work. One of them is Karen Rowden in Vancouver, who's doing um, some woven and knit articles. And the second one is Deborah Rappaport in Berkeley, California, who uses weaving uh, natural and synthetic fibers. Um, we're all concerned in doing art gallery shows and working with people in uh, environmental shows, getting people involved in museums, getting people interested in new ways of wearing, or designing, experiencing the you know, movement in clothing. clothing for friends and people about 10 years ago, but I've started working in clothing as a sculptural form only about four years ago. I decided that um, I could take clothing from out of the everyday scene and put it into um, theater performances as well as uh, sculptural forms in art galleries. Um, one of the reasons that this sort of happened is because I had so many beautiful things that I could only wear once in a while, and I found that they were hanging or draping them around the environment in which I lived in. And by um, hanging them, I could, I could um, get other ideas to continue making new forms. And then I thought perhaps I could make them in a form that they could hang or, or be sculptural or, or be placed in a center of a room or gallery and be, become a, a work of art. <laughs> of the uh, wearables that I've made are um, well, I can say a clump, or really no form. They can just be a matted mass of color. And then putting them onto a body, they become very sculptural. Uh, extending the arms and legs, it's a moving sculpture. It's, it's a, a sculpture that's encased, in, you know, around a, a body. There really is no one to follow in this field. You also get a lot of static from the papers and critics saying, well, anybody can do it. Is it really art? Is clothing art? Well, the problem is of, you know, of making it, you know, a pure aesthetic form and, and uh, where it's placed and, and how it's done. I mean, what is art today?